wireless socket set from Little Middle Isle. Is it any good? All right, let's have a look and see what we actually get. It's got a nice remote control. We're gonna, oh, it comes with batteries. That's a good. And then here is, it's as simple as wireless. Plug them in and whatever you plug in them, you can control wirelessly. So you don't need special wireless lamps or anything of the such. On, off, A, B, C, D, E. Look at that. How amazing is that? So they're nice size. You can plug into those directly and you can do stuff like what I do here. So I've got, well, I've gone to another screen there, but if I go here, there, so you can see I've got a separate lighting system here, there, green lights, and all of these are plugged in, the items plugged in, and then you can just go A, B, C, D, E, whichever one you want to turn on, and you got one remote to worry about. So that's not, not a bad idea. And anything that's old, you don't have to buy a new version or something to make it enabled for wireless or mobile phone app business. You just go straight into it. So what have we got? Let's have a look at the let's have a look at the pam pamphlet that they give you. So wireless socket set. Is there anything fancy about it? Like I said, got a timer in there or anything now. Nah, it's just plug and play. You just yeah, it's no timers or anything. There's a remote control. So we can just go A B. I'm 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 on test this, I wanna test this. And the way I'm testing it is I've put one of these in my extension. I've put the fan into it. So in theory, this red light here should come on when I press. Well, that's, that's a, on. A, B, C, D. On, A. Oh, does it need this fancy setting? There's no buttons on here. Do you want to read the guide? Is there like a special setup that you have to initiate here for me? Intended use, preparing the remote control, or oh, preparing, oh there's some preparing stuff going on. Oh my god, why can't you just plug and play mate? Come on Lidl, what are you doing? Uh, preparing the device, using the radio socket, fig B, plug the radio socket into a sufficient, yeah, yeah, yeah. Switch on electrical device, the radio socket can only take over the switching function when the electric device is switched on, yes, so, oh. Yeah, so that should be, that is on. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know how that works then. Because I plugged it in. The light, the light came on. Man, yeah, didn't work for me. Does it need, wait, has it got a battery in there? It, it has, because that's flashing. So there's definitely a battery in there. Okay, so moral of the story, if you're picking up these from Lidl, you need more brains than I've got. Okay, remote control with master function. You can switch the sockets on and off individually or all simultaneously. I pressed on, so that should put everything on. Oh, it's plugged in. Yeah, it is plugged in. Let me try with something else, just in case it's the, the fan. I'll be right back. So I thought maybe the fan was too high power, so I plugged in a charger, recharging. Let me see if this works. If I go on, A, on, B, on, C, on, D, on. No, it's not having it. Does it have to be direct eyesight or something? Yeah, it doesn't work, so. <laughs> Thank, thanks, Lidl, thanks for that. You know, it's not as easy as it looked. I read the guide and it didn't work. Let's try another one of them. Just to make sure, let's try another one of them. It could just be that one is bad, but there's four. It should all four work. Okay, so yeah, it looks like one of them was dodgy. So look at this one. A, on, on, off, off, on, on, off, off. So why did the other one not work? Let's try the other one again. There's four. Okay, yes, so all, all four did not work. I wonder if there's a fuse in here or something. Only, well, let me try out these two, because one worked, one didn't work. Let's let's test that, don't you, two. 